What's going on, guys? We're back with more Witcher here in the final part of the prologue as we watch these catapults or whatever the heck they are. They remind me of Ula's, like the uh, your Ula, the thing in the back here, the hangy ball in the back of your throat, like swinging back and forth. But apparently, then they reach down and pick up another stone. They're like half alive. All right, enough looking at them. Time to move. Stop lagging. Really now. There we go. There's a tribe of mild wild men who go into battle stark naked. What? <laughs> whoa, 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 don't laugh at me. No, we're leaving. I don't want to talk to you if you're going to laugh at me. That's rude. About this dude. Hey, buddy. Okay. We gotta go see the king. Can we please get through to see the king? Where is he at? We go the wrong way. Rippling hot air means you're near places of power. Use your medallion and press Z. Oh my, what does that do? I don't know what that means, but okay. Touch your chest. I have no idea what that does for us, but alright. Okay, so we gotta go back and go a different way. Although this place is pretty involved, it's kinda cool. Did a really nice job of making this a very lived in world. I appreciate it. Interactive objects. Let's examine this picture. What's up, picture? Hello. Enlist in the army, it says. <laughs> Alright. Hoorah. Where to? Yep. Whatever he said. Go check out the king. What's up, king? I'm going to find you. Hello, men, 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 men. A beautiful day for battle. Ah! Fear not, Excellency. We're out of range of their arbalists. Got our giant catapults are doing, no warrior, sir. doing work I here. Hey, admit, King, what's up, man? I prefer to joust verb. What's going on? Finally. Traitors of the realm boil tar on the walls while you dally with the royal advisor. How may I assist you, sire? We mount an assault today, and you'll be at my side. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's not keep the traitors waiting. Sire, you said we were out of range. That was a ballista, Excellency. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. A deadly and very costly weapon. An experienced crew can cock and release two bolts each minute. Yet it has one flaw. Your Grace, please take cover. The recoil of the arms is so strong upon firing that the weapon shifts. It simply cannot hit the same spot twice. I had no idea Your Grace was a learned military engineer. I'm not. I gave the Baroness those ballistae two years ago for her birthday. What say you, Excellency, of men who live in spite of such wounds? And what say you, Excellency, of soldiers who inflict them? Those who did this live no more. Master Geralt, I wish to converse with you once the storm of battle has subsided. Forgive me, Excellency. I plan to leave the record as soon as possible. Might I know why? Too often they take me for someone I'm not. What do they call you, soldier? Wait. You served with me at Brenneran during our foray into the Pontar Valley. Norman Sader. Still an arbalist? Yes, sir. Fight has not been kind to me. Ha! Norman Sador. For your years of faithful service to the Crown, I appoint you the Curian of the Arbalists. Onwards, gentlemen. No reason to dawdle. Okay, carefully aim the ballista. We go fire that. Quite the king. He's quite the quite the knowledgeable guy. I don't like this guy with the glasses here. He's got this one right here. This dude with the weird glasses. Forgive my candor, your majesty, but uh, I must ask, what fate awaits the royal bastards when they're my children? If I hit the bastard one more time, someone will die painfully. Your grace, forgive me, but the laws of succession are irrefutably clear. Piss on the laws. I'll change them if need be. Above all, I'll not allow a band of treacherous barons to use my children as their banner. 
Ada, your majesty, is entirely within his rights. Ada is dead. And I have no other children. I see. This conversation is over, Excellency. Please retire to your tent. Black one's in my camp for a battle. What has the world come to? Nothing would make me happier than returning his shriveled head to Emir in a sack. But Triss Merigold insisted I be patient and courteous. Was I? Hmm, patient and courteous. courteous. Oh, please, this guy. Yeah, we should be on his good side. He is a king, kind of. I couldn't have handled it better myself. I always knew you were one of us. And bugger what folks say. They talked about Adder no end. Have you learned anything about the assassin? Nothing new, sire. A month's passed and we don't know any more than we knew when we began. This investigation's going nowhere. My agents have learned little also. But we'll find the culprits. It's just a question of time. Now for the battle. I want you at my side today. Then you may go where you please. Thank you, sire. Where are you aiming, imbecile? Soldier! Spyglass! What is going on up there? The gods! Count at your valley! Cat, Witcher. Aim for the rogue with the red plume. Not six months ago, he swore eternal friendship to me. Quickly! How much higher? Hmm, do some scout work here. I guess we need to actually move this. Where is the guy in the red? Is that, is that him? Where's the guy in the red? I'm guessing that's him right there. Yeah, that guy right there. One and a half degrees. Hopefully this works. Oh yes, good work. Did we hit the bastard? He's dead. Ha! One less traitor. Time to attack. Follow me, Witcher. That's quite the uh, machine there. Or piece of war, whatever it is. <laughs> Time to load up the troops and go in for battle. So that's how the day began. That's how the prologue kicked things off. The Witcher and his king going to save the children or whatever. I guess we're now inside this thing. Follow the focus. So I guess his children, the Baroness, there's some obvious you know, Witcher, break. I'm prepared to forgive Louisa. All she need do is to kneel before her king. But he has children. Are you mocking me? Never mind. I'm certain Louisa will realize her mistakes. Besides, Children should have a mother. They should indeed. It's quite simple. Louisa and I had a bit of a tip. She made demands I could not fulfill. Understand? I think so. Count Echeverry and others immediately intervened. All noble, all sympathetic. They claimed the evil king would take her children. Red and bush, <laughs> and the you get and place them on the throne. You and you the baroness was duped. Blood and a motherly mud, love used. In truth, they desire privileges that would weaken the throne. Hmm, alright, so, we'll follow this king. Quite the complex story, this one's kind of full of uh, exposition here. That's not, not a terrible thing, I don't think. Alright, whoops, where are we going? I guess we're going up, 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 I have no idea what we're gonna, what's gonna happen when we get to the place. Whoa! About to get rocked here, apparently. Look hmm. alive, men! Hail to the king! Hail to the king, baby. Where the hell are we headed? Alright. Let's go! What the fuck do we want? Whoa there. It's a little much. Hmm. King. What do, we, what do you want to do here, bud? Eyes on the bridge! We're nearly there! Weapons at the ready!
tower was ridiculous. It was designed to break the rebels' morale. A bunch of lords and lordlings took a ride to then pompously stride on top of the walls, while the real army fought and died below them in the shit and piss-filled streets. If years of service have taught me anything, it's that the highborn don the best costumes and get the best vantage points, whether at a ball or in battle. But it's not the time for that kind of jousting, would you? Continue your story. Voltes bastards. The solo. What happened? I think it's. I thought it was over. Apparently not. We might have arrived at the same time, if not for tales. Be specific, Witcher. Well, the Archpriest told the truth. Hmm, I guess this is the final part here. The last little bit of the prologue. The culmination of this day of assault. After we got to the monastery, is my guess. That's what they're going to show us now, probably. We'll see how it rolls out. It's a little bit confusing, I might admit. There's a lot of exposition, a lot of story, a lot of plot going on here. Trying to figure it all out. His Majesty King Foltest of Temeria. Arthur Tales, erstwhile Count of Nesvelt. I signed your sentence. Yes, yet the Baroness saw fit to pardon me. An awkward situation, to be sure. Anais and Busi, where are they? The royal children. Don't test my patience, Tales, and I'll grant you a quick death. Confess, Foltest, before the gods and the people. Busi and Anais are the fruit of your loins. Bow to the gods and admit the truth. You may not have noticed, Tales, but I just took this town. Aided by murderers, sorcerers, and a mutant for whom nothing is holy. This is hallowed ground. You will not raise your hand against a servant of the gods. Where have you taken the children? The Sola. They're in the Sola. What is this? Blasphemy! Sorcerer's tricks! Hmm, should we slap him in the face or tell him to shut up? Pretty sure we should slap him in the face. He's kind of a jerk. Holy man unharmed and the noble gets slapped. A win-win situation, if ever I've seen one. I've seen assaults go awry, but the dragon topples them all. Tops. Tops what? Well, what? tops all. Damn nonsense! No, no, Geralt, no. you should know. Is it possible to tame a dragon? Not as far as I know. <laughs> yeah, not as far as I know either. Uh oh, press left button when it flashes on the screen. Uh oh, we're gonna evade the dragon apparently here. We're gonna do a little quick time thing, I think. The dragon's back! Oh god. Make sure I just press the wrong button and fried my whole career. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, I know that's not funny, but it's kind of funny that they all just burnt to a crisp. Let's try again. Game over, we know. Blow this back in. We'll run across the bridge. I didn't realize we were going to press the right mouse button. I thought it was the left mouse button. Apparently, we have to press both. Here we go. The dragon's back! Ah, the dragon! Right. Good duck. I come. Oh my! Oh my! Go, 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 King! You gotta, you gotta have to move. That thing is a beast from another planet. Good deal. Good hiding. Okay. Rah, rah, rah. I feel like I'm playing like Jurassic Park or something. Those old arcade games playing Chuck E. Cheese. Look what I'm playing here. I think we saved him. Oh God. Oh yes. That's a win for the Witcher. A sword in the mouth of the dragon. Who's now leaving? I guess he'll return later in the game. That's my guess. You saved my life again. Yes, sir. Ask what you will of me, Witcher. Within reason, of course. I need to leave, sire. I'd like Triss Marigold to come with me. If she wants. <laughs> Who goes there? Foltest. I've come for my children. Geralt, wait here. You might scare them. 
Ah, thanks be to the gods. My prayers are answered. That's not my father. But it is your king, boy. <laughs> Bells, your triumph is complete. The city and fortress taken, sire. Time to thank the forefather and the mother creatrix for this great victory. A moment, blind man. I've not seen my children in six months. The gods can spare another minute. Listen to me. Your mother and I quarreled, but that is over. She was deceived. Evil men turned her against me. These men have been punished, and all will be well from now. No tears, Busi. One day you'll be king. And kings do not weep. Armed men approach, sire. Children, go to the refectory. My knights will soon be here. You must meet them, for one day you will rule them. Usi, go wash your face. They must not see that you wept. There's a bucket of water in the next room. A nice. Help your brother. Sire, let us pray. They must look like the royal children they are. Hmm. They have your eyes, sire. Pretty sure something bad just happened. Real bad. Run, Geralt. You can save him. Or maybe you can't. Poor king. Evil blind man who wasn't really blind. Always gotta watch out for those guys. And guys, that's going to wrap this episode up. The cutscenes over. We're going to go back underneath to the castle. And from there, we will resume our journey. Thank you very much for watching. Have a fantastic day. If you like the creepy blind man who turned into a creepy killer with bulging muscles and a wrestler head, leave a like. I'd appreciate it. Till next time, guys. Have a fantastic day. We will see you later.